and that's the beauty of what we are speaking about in in uh, in the higher metaphysics as uh, God perfecting itself in man. Uh, God did not create man. The concept God did not create man. Man created God. That's right. And when you understand that man is the creator of God, then you understand that man is God. Because all concepts that we could ever perceive of God is still flawed. We are still perfecting our, our perceptual antenna so that we become higher and higher, so that we perceive more and more of that which we perceive as God. But understand that God could not perceive of itself because if it is all knowledge, it could never know itself. It could just only be. So what it did was it began to detract or separate from itself. And as it separated from itself, it created a void. And that's what they speak about in the Bible. As God separated from itself, the void that they talk about in the beginning, that's the beginning. The beginning happened when God separated from itself in its attempt to know itself. You want to deal with deep metaphysics? Then we could go into that. But to explain it the way you do verbatim and try to put limited intelligence to the words, you do yourself a disservice. You do the work a disservice that your ancestors left for you. So the separation of God from itself to know itself ended up being polarity, which is why we have the masculine and feminine principle. That separation to create the void, that void that we are feeling with one another when a man needs a woman and a woman just needs that man, that's the void. In the beginning, God created the heavens and earth, and the earth was about form, and everything was void. Yes, there was a void. That void was when the Most High pulled away from itself to know itself. Because being all of itself, it could only know itself. It could never know itself. It could only be. In your book in Exodus, you saw uh, that uh, Moses was spoken to, and he said he was spoken to by an entity called that said it was I am that I am. And then again he turned to be I am. So I am that I am speaks to a static perfection. No movement. When you say I am, or I am that will be, that's that static perfection in movement. And I am that will be became Adam. And Adam left the garden, or was kicked out of the garden. He had to be kicked out of the garden, because perfection is death. That's why the Most High creates, in order to perfect itself. Anything that's totally perfect dies of its own volition, because there's nothing to do. Cancer perfects itself in your body. How does cancer perfect itself? By killing you. <laughs> 